Welcome back to Dice Station Zebra with Jocelyn and Rob, and today we are playing Marvel Studios Hero Clicks Next Phase, sealed game number five. There's Wong on the title card, which I've already opened in a previous game, but Jocelyn, perhaps you will open Wong in one of your oh, boosters. Perhaps. And what we do here is we open up a single booster each this time. In this series, we're just doing single boosters, mm -hmm. and we make teams that are very close in points and we play a game yeah we make teams where jocelyn has more points mm. than rob and then jocelyn loses that's how <laughs> it goes here so you're gonna open first i am it's a very light booster so yeah there's no abomination in this one and i do like that your nails very much match the box yeah nicely done if uh if you know anything about holidays you might figure out what the colors are meant for but okay <laughs> there's cards we're close to easter let's just say that Ooh, that's uh that's ms oh. marble is it yeah, it's a common, I think. Um, tea package. We've got a Maya Lopez. We've got uh, a Mr. Immortal. I've got a Hulk. And I have a Hawkeye. Nope, I have a Clint Barton. He's my rare, it looks like. Hmm. I think you, I think there's some... Oh, something weird going on in this kit. Well, it looks That's, like Is that a Yelena? Who is that? That's a Maya Lopez. You have... A Jack Duquesne card, and I don't see a Jack Duquesne in your own Oh, this is kit. this is bad. There's a Hulk. We got Hulk. There's a She-Hulk. Don't have you her. You don't have a She-Hulk. There's a Yelena and a Kazi. So we, we got some uh, mix-up wow. in the cards. Wow. So but that's okay. What are we going to do about this? Well, we have all the dials on HC units, so. That's going to be interesting. That's interesting. Because this is the only card that matches is Hulk. Yeah. Mr. Immortal, Clint Barton. Oh, that's strange. Maya Lopez, Ms. Marvel, now all I, incorrect. Now, I have seen that um, somebody online got a, ch a chase booster, <coughs> a yeah. Moon Knight chase booster with uh, no cards. The Moon Knight theme booster, yeah. The theme booster. Yeah. That's that's it. You know. um, should we look at Hulk since he's the only one we have a <laughs> let's card do for? It. Let's do uh, it. Let's do that. Okay. Because trying to pull up HC units while we're doing this is going to be a little challenging. So let's, uh, let's, take look let's take a look at Hulk. Set number 30, he's got the Avengers Initiative TA, Avengers Brute <coughs> Celebrity Monster and Scientist. His trait being a Hulk asks for balance, super strength, traded. Characters within three squares can't use Battle Fury. That's pretty wow, cool. Wow, interesting. Uh, special attack power. Hurl boulders into orbit. Quake, when Hulk knocks back one or more characters, double the amount of knockback. When Hulk is given a ranged terrain action, he has a minimum range value of 7. And mm. Avengers Initiative, which grants him improved targeting through stealth. 80 points, 7 clicks, charge, sidestep, flurry, the special attack power all the way down the dial, impervious into regen, and then he starts with shape change, then he gets outwit, and then he gets close combat expert. Awesome. And nothing fancy on the back. So just listing the cards. Let's just powers. head over and see what your booster says. All right, let's see what we get in my booster. Hopefully my cards match. Fingers crossed. All right. <coughs> Let's see. Okay, well, that is a Yelena. Two Yelenas. Is that an Emil Blonsky? I got that guy, Johnny Blaze, I think his name is. Yeah. And, um... Another dude? Who is this guy? I have no idea. So, I think Johnny Blaze that is That is Red Dagger. Red Dagger. He's a rare. Um, John, yeah, Donnie Blaze and Red Dagger are both rares. Yelena, you have two different Yelenas, you're right. Mm -hmm. And Emil Blonsky. So who do we want to take a look at? I don't know. Who looks cooler? Red um, Dagger? Sure. Okay. Donnie Blaze is unique for some reason. Oh, well, let's, so. look at let's look at him then. I mean, we can look at both of them. So let's take a look at Donnie. <coughs> Donnie Blaze. I call him Johnny Blaze. Jeez. I think so. I'm getting my wires crossed. He's number 34 in the set. He's unique. Um, and he's a rare. Celebrity mystical keywords, mystic's team ability, and he's got this trait. It's there's a lot of text here. Mm -hmm. Ta-da! Hey, all part of the show. That's what it's called. At the beginning of the game, generate a portal marker five squares away from any map edge. At the beginning of your turn, you may generate a number nine demon on click one. Well, that's not going to happen because I didn't pull one. Nope. Um, adjacent to the portal marker, if you do roll a d6. Okay. Well, I guess this is not going to happen. Not in a sealed game. This trait will not uh, occur for this uh, nope. This game. But however, on a roll of one through three, you the generated demon is friendly to an opponent's force and has not scored when KO'd this game. 
And on a result of 4, you generate another number 9 demon on click 1, adjacent to the portal marker, then remove the portal mar marker from the game. 5 or 6 has no effect. Okay. Okay. Interesting. So we take a look at the back, because it looks like we got a trait. We have a special, a special movement move power. power. Yep. So he has the Stolen Sling Ring, which grants phasing teleport and sidestep. For free, you place Donnie Blaze or an adjacent friendly character up to four squares away from their current square. If you do, an opponent may then place that character up to one square away from their new current square. Interesting. He's okay. got mystics. Hmm. All right. Um, well, a lot of that is not going to matter yeah. in the sealed game. No. Uh, but basically, you've got Force Blast. Is that Force Blast on the close I combat? Um, yes. Force Blast? No, Smoke Cloud. Smoke Cloud, oh. Smoke Cloud, Barrier, and Shape Change. Interesting. Well, I don't think he's all that great. I don't know what he's going to do for me if I can't make demons, but let's take a look at Red Dagger. I let's mean, he's slap got him up on Shape the Change, I guess? On the thing here. Let, he's number 33 in the set. Um, cosmic Martial Artist Spy Warrior Keywords. He's got a trait that says Red Scarf, which grants stealth, lines of fire drawn to Red Dagger, or adjacent friendly characters that cross the rim of elevated terrain are hindered. Uh, special movement power, look beyond what's in front of you. Grant sidestep, Red Dagger can't be targeted by opposing characters unless they're adjacent to him. At the beginning of your turn, you may deal Red Dagger one unavoidable damage. I guess that would, could get him to his special attack power. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a, uh, what do you call it? A um, activation click. Mm -hmm. So let's see what's on that special attack power. The red dagger, which grants blades, claws, fangs, and giant reach three. Well, that's pretty neat. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Well, well, let's dig up some cards for you, <laughs> and we'll set up the map. Sounds good. Okay, we have determined our teams. Jocelyn, tell us about your team. Uh, well, thank you to Clay Wood and HC Units for <laughs> allowing me to figure <laughs> out what my team does. Yeah. Uh, so I actually dropped Mr. Immortal from my team because right. I had too many points. Yes. Nobody had lower point dials, so it's just the one, mm -hmm. one point value. So I have Hulk, mm -hmm. I have Ms. Marvel, I have Maya Lopez, and I have Clint Barton. So I have a Hulk card, which yep. came in the booster. And the rest of them I have up on a little computer screen here that I've screen capped off HC unit, so I know what Perfect. I'm doing. Perfect. Uh, I make 245 points non-theme. Yes. And that's my peeps. I'm also 245 points non-theme. Um, I'm I've got the two Yelena's, uh, masked and unmasked, Red Dagger, Emil Blonsky, and Donnie Blaze, of course. Yeah, and I think you have leadership. I have leadership on Emil. Yeah, I don't get leadership till halfway down Clint's dial, so. Mm. I'm not. Uh, I'm not hopeful. Although I do get to make two free attacks. Ms. Marvel has the ability to make a free attack, oh, and nice. so does Clint. So fingers crossed that will help. Okay. And uh, we rolled off camera as we usually do, and yeah. Rob won the roll. He decided to select map. So tell so me about this map, Rob. So this map is called the Bloodstone Maze. It's an outdoor map. Cool. Um, I believe this is from the Werewolf by Night. Uh, this is what it's based on. From the OP kit or something? Um, it's an OP map. Yeah. Um, but the, actu the the theme of the map is from the, the TV special that was um, Werewolf by Night. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So I'm set up. Okay. And I'm just going to set up my people. So taking a look, you can see there's quite a lot of barrier in this map. All these brown squares are all barrier. Then we have quite a lot of uh, terrain, um, hindering terrain. Uh, which is good, because I have someone who sees through that. Hulk sees through that. Mm -hmm. uh, I guess maybe for his outwit, because he doesn't make ranged attacks. <laughs> but we'll figure it out. Um, but uh, but yeah, so there's that's basically it. The map is just one level. There's no elevation. Yeah. And uh, that's the whole thing. It's kind of a... It's a bit of a colorless map. It's gray. There's some brown here for the blocking. Yeah, green and, and white. And the green, yeah. All right. All right, I'm well, ready to go if you are. Good luck. Good luck. And you're going to start us off, right? I am. Okay. All right, so uh, Ms. Marvel has sidestep, so she's going to sidestep one, two. She's then going to use her special um, defense power. Avengers Con is going to be epic. Mm -hmm. And she's going to use that to generate four barrier terrain mar markers. Okay. And we'll go like so. And that's a costed action. And then we're going to take Maya, and she's going to move up to here. She has a move of six, so she can do that. She'll go one, two, three. She's going to go here, actually, four. 
And then we're going to take Clint and move Clint to there. And that's all I can do. I've only got three actions, so I'm going to pass over to you. Okay. Uh, Jocelyn, one thing I have to do, I should have done at the beginning of the game, is Yelena has a trait called the target. Oh. At the beginning of the game, for all friendly characters with this trait, give a target token to an opposing character. For all characters with this trait, when a friendly character with the assassin keyword KOs an opposing character with the target token, score 25 victory points. I don't know if that's going to win me the game, but we will name Clint Barton. Okay. So Clint Barton is my uh, target. I put an imaginary target token on my computer where I'm viewing <laughs> the cards. Perfect. Now, Donnie Blaze. Um, for free, place Donnie Blaze or an adjacent friendly character up to four squares away from the current square. So I can do that. I can go, it doesn't need line of fire, it's just a place. One, two, three, four. Okay. Um, if you do, an opponent may then place that character up to one square away from their new square. Ooh, I get to move him. Yep. Hi. Oh, wow. Okay. The closer you are to me, the easier it is for me to attack you. He has a uh, sidestep. Okay. So I'm going to sidestep him there. Bring him in even closer. And let's see. We are then going to sidestep Emil Blonsky. Um, yep, he has sidestep on his top click Kay. to there. Um, red dagger on his special movement power, which is only on his first click. Um, he will sidestep to there. Mm -hmm. um, he has perplex. So, um, actually, he should have done that first. He was going to perplex up this Yelena. Sure. If that's okay with you. Perplex up the defense. Perplex the up defense. Okay. Yep. And then now we're going to do some costed actions. So this Yelena will come up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And then this Yelena will go one, two, three, four, five, and six to here. Okay. And then Donnie Blaze, because he's only done Freeze. three things right now, so I can still use my barrier ability. Mm -hmm. So he is going to take a power action to generate barrier. Okay. And barrier is four squares within, first square has to be within line of fire, and they all have to be within range, correct? That's right. So I'll just read it. Power minimum range four. Generate up to four blocking terrain markers one at a time in distinct squares within range. Other than the first, each marker must be adjacent to at least one other, and at least one marker with be, must be within line of fire. Okay. At the beginning of your next turn, even if this is lost, remove them. So we will bring down... Well, we will basically make a big barrier here. I mean, that's mean. There we go. That's mean. <laughs> it is. Boxing you in. Okay, that is... Um, th I get four actions, right? Uh, I heard you have leadership, so yeah. I have leadership. So... You've only done three things. I am going to, actually going to give Emil a costed. One, two, three, four, five. Mm, let's put him up here. One, two, three, four to here. Okay. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Yeah. One, two, three, four. There we go. That is my turn. Okay. Well, I have no leadership, no willpower, no any beginning of the turn things. Okay. So I see we're playing the barrier game, Rob. Yep. You know, you and I don't usually play the barrier game. We don't. We're very... We don't use barrier enough. The so. only reason I'm using it is because of the uh, trait on her. Yeah. It is very useful, though. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we are going to do things Kay. and stuff. So first <laughs> off, Maya is going things to and stuff. charge and destroy this barrier marker as part of her charge. Yep. Um, it is not water. It will become hindering. That's right. weird that the other side of these are water. Yeah, that is very bizarre. So let's put a debris there, which Perfect. that debris comes down at the beginning of my turn. That's right. So now I have an opening Yep. because I charged on that barrier. Yep. And she needs to take an action token for that. I do only have two more actions. So we're going to go with Clint next. Okay. Clint has running shot with a range of eight. One, two, three, four. 
from here, he would have line of fire on Donnie, line of fire on Yelena, and line of fire on Yelena. Okay. So he's going to charge, running shot, precision strike with so, range yeah. combat expert. So, yeah, this Yelena can only be targeted within two squares. This Yelena has stealth, but that's not an issue right now. Yep. And so this one was perplexed up. So, yeah, you are up against, yeah, a 19. She's a 19. Okay. She's an 18. 18 plus the hindering. So oh, 19. plus the hindering. Yep. Yep. He doesn't have uh, Avengers Initiative or anything? No. Oh, that's interesting. Donnie Blaze is also an 18. And oh, he, he does have Avengers Initiative. Yeah, I figured he might. Yep. Yeah, so you can see right through that. Yep. Um, Donnie Blaze, I will give you the reminder, he does have Mystics. That's fine. So if you hit him, or if you, he does, takes damage, you will take one. I have to I have to hit him anyway. I yeah. have Precision Strike, so. Okay. So in theory, I will be able to hit all three of them. And do one point to each. And do one point to each, if that's what I choose to do. Sure. Anyway, first off, Range Combat Expert, 12. Mm-hmm. Okay. 12 plus 7. Yep. Hitting 19s. That'll get them all. All right. So how many clicks is Donnie? <laughs> Donnie is five clicks total. He's five clicks total. And how? Oh, does sorry. Hold on a second. One. We have shape change on Donnie. Oh, okay. So we have to retcon that. I roll a one. So you got him. Okay. <coughs> uh, he's five clicks. Yes. Does he have a reducer? D he does not. He no. does not. And how no. how far is his barrier power go? Um, the entire dial. The entire dial. Yeah. Okay. Very annoying. We're going to put all three Kay. into um, Donnie. Wow. Okay. If I'm going to take the Mystics, then I want to put, yeah. I want to make it effective. One, two, and three. Okay. Okay. Now, Clint has a trait called Coin Trick. Okay. Free. Make a range attack using in cap. I have three targets with a range of six. For free? For free. I like it. So he is still a 12 because he still gets ranged combat expert. 12 plus 6. So I'm yeah. going to hit I'm going to hit uh, 18s. 18s. Well, Donnie Blaze went down to a 17, so you got him. She's perplexed up to a 19, right? I thought she was perplexed. Didn't we say it was oh, masked? Yelena was, was the perplexed. Masked Yelena, I'm sorry. So I incapped those two. Yeah. And incap does Ooh. not grant mystics. Nicely done. Because there's no damage. Mhm. Mm and that was free. Okay. Um, I'm going to side step Ms. Marvel. Mm -hmm. And then I think I need to move Hulk in. Okay. So I think, seeing as I've double tokened some of your people, plus Hulk has annoying things like shape change and impervious, uh, we're just going to go full move. One, yep. two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight mm -hmm. to here, tying up that there potentially. Mm -hmm. uh, Ms. Marvel will clear. Yep. And I will pass turn to you. Okay, so beginning of my turn, this comes down. Yep, and I think you have leadership somewhere, right? I do. Yep, from Emil. Oh. Emil Blonsky. I got a five. I'll re roll that with imaginary leadership <laughs> prop. <laughs> nice try. So we get to take a token off Mast Yelena. All right. Okay. All right, so Mast Yelena, or sorry, this Yelena, unmast Yelena, has outwit. Okay. She's going to outwit your impervious. How rude. I know. And then, <laughs> then Red Dagger has sidestep. Mm -hmm. He sidesteps to here. He's got perplex. He'll perplex Hulk down to 17. Sure. So now Hulk's impervious is uh, per, er, outwitted, and he's perplexed to a 17 defense. Mm -hmm. And then Red Dagger has a range of three. He will do a ranged attack on Hulk. And you, I think you have shape change. I do. Mm -hmm. Shape change says four. You okay. can try and hit me. So Red Dagger is a 10 attack. Um, yeah, 10 attack. 10 on, on 17. 17. There's an eight. That'll hit. For two points. Two points. Damage. Okay. One, two. All right. And then we give Red Dagger a token. I now have Sidestep and Outwit. Okay. And then Mast Yelena. Mm -hmm. You are now a printed 17, so you're a 16. Mm -hmm. So I'll be 11 on 16. Yep. Need a five. 
That is exactly a five. That is exactly a five. For three points. Three points, okay. Three clicks of damage. One, two, three. He's still alive. What's oh, yeah. he got now? He's got regen and close combat expert and flurry. Close combat expert? Mm hmm. Okay. Well, this is going to be a really. Oh, hold on a second. He has he has empower, so it would have been one more into Hulk. Sorry about that. He's still alive. I forgot about the empower. Um, so this is a long shot, but Emil Blonsky is going to sidestep Kay. here to here mm -hmm. and try to hit Hulk. Okay. It'll be a ten on seventeen. Ten on seventeen. All right, come on, Emil. It's only a three. That's too bad. That is too bad. Do you have prob? I don't know. So now Donnie Blaze could, in theory, move for free. Do his free move. Mm -hmm. um, let me look at um, this Yelena. She has okay. Um, should Donnie Blaze move? Let's check it out. Yeah, Donnie is going to move. Um, so using his free one, two, three, four. Using his free. So Kay. I'm placing him there, which means you get to move him up to one square away. You're just moving him right in. Yeah. Perfect. Because then if you want to size step, you got to break I, away. Yeah, that's true. But I was going to put him in there anyway. So. And we clear those people. Okay. And it is your turn. All right. So, Mr. The Donnie Blaze. Yeah. Is a 17. And he is in hindering. Mm -hmm. Because as we've mentioned, I have no leadership or willpowers. So... If I make a ranged terrain action using telekinesis, um, does that impact your the fact that you're in hindering? It would, right? The terrain's being thrown at you, so your defense would be plus one? Yeah, because it's a range action. It's a range action. Yeah, Capital makes sense. range. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, Rob. Yeah. I think Emil had willpower. Oh, he did too. So do you want to roll that? Yeah, let's do that. I should have done that. So he would have taken a token off. Okay. Thanks yeah. for the reminder. Yeah, it's it's good to know because um, it's going to change how my turn works. Yep. So. Okay. So we're going to start with Mr. The Hulk. He's got Flurry, Close Combat Expert. Um. So he's a twelve for four. Okay. He's going to attack a meal first. Okay. Twelve on. Uh, it's a seventeen. Twelve on seventeen. So I need a five. First attack is a three. Oh. Second attack on a meal. Okay. That'll hit four, four. Four damage into a meal. Yep. I think that'll One, take him out. Two, three. That he's gone. Yay. Good shot. Now I knew it was risky putting him in there, yep. but um, you know, I was hoping that he would get the kill shot on Hulk. Yeah. But I he mean, did not. It was worth a shot. Yeah. No pun intended. <laughs> okay. So next. Ms. Marvel is going to generate her barrier. Okay. As a costed action. So she will put one here. And then we're going to go here, here, and here. Nice. Because they're all within range and one's within line of fire. Okay. Now for free, she's going to pick this up. With telekinesis. Yep. And make a range tray in action and throw it at Donnie. Okay. So she is a 10. And he's a, s oh, he's a 17 and he has shape change. Yep. Now that's considered an attack, right? It Which is. Which means I can yep. attempt to shape change out of it. And he only got a three. Okay. So you're an 18 because you're in that hindering and I don't have Avengers initiative. So 10 on 18 with the terrain marker, which will be three damage if I hit. I need an eight. That is a 10. Yep. So that will be three damage on Donnie. Yep, Donnie is KO'd. And I think I take a Mystics, right? And you right? get a Mystics, that's correct. Because it came from her. So All she right. got to make that free terrain action with the barrier she generated. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Clint has improved targeting through characters with black. So he's going to uh, try to in-cap for free both the Yelinas. Oh, that's a free ability. I totally it's forgot free, about yeah, that. It's free, yeah, coin trick. Um, he can, sh can he shoot while adjacent? He's not adjacent oh, yeah, to I, an opposing. I'm sorry. That's right. Hulk's yard. 
Hulk's mine. That's right. Donnie was beside him. Yeah. You've KO'd Donnie. Yeah. Perfect. So, um, you're that, going for. That was the plan. And so, you can shoot through your own characters. I yep. have improved targeting awesome. characters. So, 12 with the range combat expert for in cap. 12 on range numbers. It's just an in cap. Okay. 12 plus 5. I'm hitting 17s. Do I get either of them? No, they're both 18. Okay. Well, it was free. Yeah. So, I tried. Yep. Um, it would have been nice, but uh, things happen. So Clint will clear because he made an in cap for free, and uh, Maya will clear. Okay. And everybody else took an action, so it's over to you. Okay. And I no longer have leadership. Woo -woo. So, but that's okay. All right. Well, I'm going to apply my perplex again on Hulk. We're going to make him a 17 defense. Sure. And then, uh, oh, you know what? Um, I think, yeah, we're just going to shoot again. Red Dagger mm -hmm. is going to shoot. A 10 on your 17. Yep, 10 on 17. Oh, that's only a 6. That misses. Yikes. Sad base. Yep. Well, let's see if um, perhaps Masculina can hit. Yep. 11 on 17. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's oh, a 5. Bummer. Okay. Well... Final Yelena here. 11 on 17. I'm going to try to take down Hulk. <laughs> 6. That's a 17. 11 uh, plus 6. 11 plus 6 is 17. He's perplexed down. That's yep. 3 points of damage. He's dead. He's dead. He was okay. on his last click. Nice. I could have regenned him last turn, but I felt like trying to take out a meal was the smarter plan. And then Red Dagger has a sidestep. Yep. He will sidestep. Um, actually, he's got stealth. But you can see through stealth with him, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. But there's something else on here. Um, he can't be targeted by opposing characters unless they're adjacent to him. Okay. So I don't think even uh, uh, Hawkeye could see him, right? Hawkeye can't see him from t from where he is. No. But you know what? I might sidestep him anyway, just to get him closer to the action. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put him into here. Okay. And that is my turn. Okay. Pass so over to you. I'm going to remove my barrier mm -hmm. and build a e epic strategy. Okay. Oh, and Jocelyn, at the end of my turn, I'm going to use my outwit from Yelena. Okay. Um, before I pass, I'm going to use that on Clint Martin's uh, range combat expert. All right. Seems like a plan. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Clint's going to go first. Yeah. Um, apparently, he no longer has range combat expert. No, he does not. So he will be an 11 for two. He does have two targets, so he'll target them both. Sure. So and they are going to be 18s. Well, he, oh, he sees through hindering. That's right. So yeah, she's an 18. 11 on 18. So he has seven or better. So here's the ranged attack. Yep. That is uh, 18s. Yep. Um, I think I'll put all two into her. Okay. Oh, it is precision strike. No, I'll put all two in. Put two in. I think i got to consolidate my... One... Damage because she's is, yeah she's double token. She's anyway. now a seventeen defense. Okay. Mm -hmm. Printed printed seventeen with combat reflexes, of course. Uh, Ms. Marvel's gonna sidestep one, two over here. Next to Clint. Yep. And then she's gonna generate her barrier. Kay. She's gonna go. Um, now, did Clint want to do his in capping thing before you do anything else? Is that still a thing he can do? It is still a thing he can do. Yeah. It's okay. I have a plan. Okay. Uh, we're going to do this Yep. with the barrier. And that's a costed action. What color do they use? Black. Okay. All right. So now for free, she's going to pick up this terrain marker uh -huh. and throw it at Yelena. Cool. Cool. And uh, I did it wrong. I didn't do it wrong. I did it correctly last game, last turn. But it's not plus to her damage when you do a ranged terrain action. It's just a default two when it's a general. Default genera, two, so. which was enough to get Donnie. Which was. So uh, 10 on 18 because it's hindered. Mm -hmm. So 10 on 18 with the terrain marker. I need an 8 or better. That is a 7. So that Thanks. misses. Mm -hmm. um, now we will... Uh, Charge in with Maya. Okay. Charge to here. Yep. 11 on, I think, 19. 19 because of the combat reflexes. Combat. I need an 8 or better. 
That's a three. Okay. So that misses. And then Clint will free in cap on Yelena. Perfect. 11 plus, four uh -oh. misses. Yikes. So that's my turn. Okay. I did all the things. So over to me, and she has outwit, and I'm going to outwit um, actually red dagger. Oh, did he? That's what was a free, right? So he didn't get a token? Uh, no, you know? he took a token for the yep. range, and then he the in cap was a free. Does she have uh, stealth? Nope. Okay. So red dagger will sidestep over. Mm hmm. So that he can perplex her down to a 17. Sure. And then she is going to outwit her combat reflexes. Okay. And Yelena will attack. So that will be an 11 against a 17. Yep. That's an 8. That'll hit. Okay, for three points. Three points. Okay. One, two, three. And then my people clear. And okay. it's back over to you. Okay. So my barrier goes away. Mm -hmm. um, and I have my range combat expert now. Yep. So let's uh, range combat expert. And I can actually see all three of them now. If I believe, right? I can see. You, um, well, she, oh, he can see through characters. So yes. yes. I can see all three of them. Because that's a direct line. I can see yep. through characters. So I am target all of them. Perfect. So I'm a 12 on your numbers. Mm-hmm. With precision strike. So 12 plus 5. I hit 17s. That'll hit 17s. So you hit Blonde Yelena. Yep. And it looks like um, I also hit uh, Red Dagger, but he's got super senses. Oh, actually, um, Red Dagger, special movement power. Red Dagger can't be targeted by opposing characters unless they're adjacent to him. Okay. So he's not a target. He's not a target. So you got Yelena. Yelena. And this Yelena is more, right? She's an 18. Okay. So I'll put all three into that Yelena. Okay. One, two, three. Now Yelena has shape change. Okay. Um, I will in cap for free, mm -hmm. targeting that Yelena, I guess. Yep. Because the other one's got two tokens on her. Mm -hmm. 12 on 18. Yep. That'll hit. Nice. So she's in capped. And Maya is going to attempt a breakaway sidestep. Okay. So I need a four or better. And that's a four. Um, so she... She's got plasticity. She does? Yeah. It says flurry in her dial. Is it traded? It's... Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. She's lost that. Yeah, special movement power is now gone. Yeah. Yeah. One, two. Right there. Nicely done. Okay. And I have and two targets. My outwit is gone now as well. What had you outwitted? I don't even remember. Um, oh, range combat. combat expert. No, it was oh, combat, combat reflexes. reflexes. Okay. That's right. Okay, so I have close combat expert, and I have um, uh, a 10, so I'm an 11. Mm -hmm. And I'll target both of these guys. Sounds good. Two and the blonde Yelena's got shape change. Yep. Got a 5. Okay. got so out of it. I'll flip to this target. Yep. To So y Yelena, Mass Yelena, and Red Dagger. Yep. Okay. Okay. And I'm an 11 mm -hmm. on your numbers. 11 plus 8, so I'm hitting 19s. Mm, so Mass Yelena is a 20. Okay. And Red Dagger is a 17, but he does have Super Senses. Okay. On this, well, first and fourth clicks. He's got those, so I'm going to roll Super Senses. He only got a 4. Okay, so all 3 damage will go into him. Okay. Nicely done. And then I'll knock him back. 1, 2... Three, you said four damage? Three damage. Three damage. Yeah. Knock him back. Three. One, two, three. Just because I can? Yep. Um, and he can no, he cannot use um, attack powers after he's been hit by Maya. For the next turn? Yeah, so when Maya Lopez hits with a close attack, hit characters can't use attack powers until my next turn. Oh, neat. Okay, and then Clint did a thing, so uh, it's just Ms. Marvel that clears. Okay. And I pass turn to you. Okay, so Red Dagger then will... Now, he can attack. He just can't use attack powers. That's right. Okay. So he will sidestep to here. Mm -hmm. He does have range 3. And he does have perplex on this click. Okay. So we're going to perplex 
Maya's defense down, of course. Yep. So that will be a 16. Mm -hmm. And Red Dagger will shoot 10 on 16. Okay. That's an 8. That'll hit. For 2 points. All right. I have toughness. So I take one, uh, take 2. Mm -hmm. 1, 2. Okay. But, but less. Uh, you have toughness, though. So you yep. Didn't you say it was 3? No, it's 2 damage. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Okay. I think I said 2. I don't know at this point. Okay, I took one back. Yep. So one. now she is a printed 15 because her defense value went down. She is a printed 16 and a perplexed oh, sorry. 15. <laughs> right. Yeah. Printed 16, perplexed down. So Yelena will, Master Yelena will attack 11 on the 15. Yep. Give her a token. Um. Okay, 11 on 15. That's a 7. That'll hit. That'll be 3 damage. That'll be enough to take her out. Okay. Because she'll take two, one, two, and she is KO'd. This Yelena will clear. Okay. And it's back to you. I went to put her on her card, but I don't have one. <laughs> okay, so yeah. basically this turn, I have um, Clint, and I have Ms. Marble. And right. Clint is double token, so he can only use free ink at. Uh, Jocelyn, I just realized something. I did something wrong. You did? Red Dagger only has sidestep on his first Top click. Oh. So. So um, he couldn't have sidestepped and have attacked sidestepped. me. So he would have been there. Yep. And he couldn't have. Yeah, that's right. He couldn't have sidestepped and attacked you. And I only have range three. Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to give him a costed move to come here. Okay. Right. Then he perplexed Maya. Yep. Yelena's hit was good. Yep. Right. She she got her for the three less your toughness. Mm -hmm. But you do get a click back because he did not attack you. Okay. So basically what happens then is Maya comes back here with her two tokens. That's right. On, um, her, on, a th on what click? On her last click. On her last click, okay. But she she would clear. Yes. Right? I think so. So she's cleared now. No, because it's now it's my turn. She'd be double tokened. Okay, we're good. So, and the reason why I'm putting red dagger there um, instead of moving him all the way up is because his special attack power which i can't use this turn mm -hmm. has giant reach three and blades so Got he's going to be right there okay so maya has to be double tokened because she acted last turn so that's she, right she should have the same tokens that clint does right is what should be should be happening here sorry so. about the mess up but we well, fixed it i'm glad we fixed it yep um okay so I think that's how it should look. Yep, that's and exactly how it should look. And I <laughs> will just have the free right. that I can make with Clint this turn, as well as whatever I do with Maya. Or with Ms. Marvel, I mean. Yep, sounds good. Okay. Okay, I think I got my head wrapped around this. <laughs> uh, so Maya's going to try and break away sidestep. Yep. A three is not enough. Okay. So she will stay right where she is. Right. Seems completely reasonable. Um, free in cap from Clint. Okay. Uh, shape change. Okay. I can in cap. You can do it. So I'm a 12 on your 17. Mm -hmm. I need a 5 for a free in cap. That's a 6. Nicely done. So she is in capped. One token. I can just see how, I know we haven't pulled them yet, but the trick arrows could be really good on Clint. Oh yeah, for sure. Kay. All right. So... Uh, that breakaway failed. All right, so we're going to... I'm just going to read Barrier again, because I don't use it that often. So Barrier says, Generate up to four blocking terrain markers, one at a time, in distinct squares within range. At least one must be adjacent to one other, and at least one must be within line of fire. So I don't have to put them within line of fire. Just one of just them. Just one of them. Mm -hmm. So I could do... And all have to be within range, of yeah. course. One... Two, mm -hmm. three. Yep, you're gonna block four. my my red dagger. <laughs> I can do that. <laughs> Nicely done. Okay, and then I will use this terrain marker with my free attack. Now, does she? Would she have line of fire if she did that? So let's read it. What I would do, maybe, to ensure she has line of fire, is to do this like that. So then she can pick this one up. And fire it at Yelena? Yes, but I was, don't want you to be able to. Oh, you're Jason anyway. <laughs> okay. Just because um, if she's there, yeah. you might not have a line of fire. Because you can't see through your own character, right? Or does she have improved targeting? So let's read ranged, sure. ranged train action. 
if this character is holding a train marker, which she can make ranged attacks with her train markers as if she's holding them. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, make a ranged attack targeting a single character within line of fire. So the character does need to be within line of fire. Yeah. So this terrain marker. Yeah. Um, so this is not going to work, this placement. No, it is. If that's there, I don't have line of fire to her. Yeah, but you don't you pick this up? It's as if I'm holding oh, it. Oh, as if you're holding it. Yeah. So in that case, I need, point. I need to change this. Okay. So let's... Welcome to our barrier cl- clinic. I know, right? <laughs> Station Ziva. Okay. We're we're learning how to do this. So we will do it like. Yeah, that's cool. Like so. It's too bad you can't block the. I guess. The guy. I mean, maybe there's a way I can do it, but I can't think of it. Okay, so I will pick up this one, mm-hmm. and I will throw it at her. Okay. And so you there's get a, shape, a change. shape change. Yeah. Got a four. Okay. Valid target. So ten on eighteen. Because of the hindering. Because of the hindering, need an eight. That's a three, mm-hmm. so it misses. Okay. Uh, everybody else will clear. Okay. So Maya clears because she failed her thing, and the end cap was free. And sorry, I knocked the camera. And pass it to you. Okay, sounds good. Um, well, I think the best thing I should do to do right now is for red dagger because he has giant reach three right now Mm -hmm. with blades do you Um, have an outwit you need to apply i don't know because you clicked me off that so he does have perplex though so i will perplex maya down to a 15 okay and then red dagger will do giant reach three okay 10 on 15 Mm -hmm. that's an eight yep that'll hit and i don't think i need to do blades right because she's last click i think but i should roll blades anyway um yeah, well, you need two, right? Three. Okay. Three from Blades. All right, she's dead. Okay. For real this time. And this Yelena. Oh, she does not have a move and attack. She does have a range of three, so she could shoot. Yeah, but uh, shooting Clint is not a good idea. Does she have a reducer, Ms. Marvel? Uh, Ms. Marvel just has toughness and barrier. And I'm only doing two points of damage. So I'm going to just do a costed move because I have flurry. Okay. So I'll put her there. Maya will do that. See, that ties up your range person, too. Yeah. So my barrier comes down. And uh, we got the stuff to do. Okay. Ms. Marvel is going to attempt a breakaway sidestep. And she gets it. Nicely done. So she's going to sidestep one, two. Mm -hmm. And because it's uh, safer... She's going to use her TK to TK Clint. Nice. And she's going to TK Clint to there. Nice. Because Clint can make uh, ranged attacks through characters. Yeah. So I can see this Yelena, and I can see this Yelena. Yep. So I will 12. So this is just a... Range range combat expert. Range combat expert. Yep. Cool. I'm going to roll shape change on blonde Yelena. Yep. Got a four. Okay. 12 on numbers. Yep. 12 plus, roll high. Nope, four. Ooh. That's only going to hit 16s. I don't think it hits either it of them. It does not hit either. Oh, that's so sad. All right. Uh, in cap for free. Okay. That one will hit. Yeah, that gets her. So she's in capped. Okay. Sad face. Okay, and uh, that's my turn. That's your turn. Okay, so I, there, I can only do one thing. So um, this Yelena... Mm-hmm. Sorry, perplexing down Ms. Marvel. Sure. To a 16. Shape change. And then this Yelena attacks her. Shape, yep. change, Shape change says you can try. 11 on 16. That's an 11. That'll hit. For three points. Less toughness. Toughness, okay. And then I just One, clear my other two. people. Okay. It's your turn. All right. So I guess Clint does the attack again. Yep. 12 on numbers. And a shape change. You can target her. 12 plus wow. 9. Wow, there you go. I hit them both. You did. Now, I'll tell you how much damage you need on this one. Yep. You need one, two to get her. Okay, so I'll put two into her. Yep, two on blonde Yelena. She's yep. gone. And then one into her. One into her. Yep. Okay. Okay. 
and um, I can only in-cap him with a ranged attack, but I can't make a ranged attack because of his thing, right? He has a power or something? Um, no, that's gone. Oh, that's <coughs> gone? But you don't have line of fire, right? No, I don't have line of fire because of the blocking terrain. Mm -hmm. So it's not going to matter. Uh, all right, I'm going to... Does he have a move and attack? <coughs> he does not. No. All right, well, then I'm going to try and break away sidestep. Okay. That will get it with Nicely a six. Done. So she's going to go one, two, I guess. Okay. And pass turn to you. Oh, okay. she clears. Right? She didn't do yep. a thing. Yeah. So I guess then... Um, maybe I'm going to do a costed move here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. Let's do that. So this guy's going to come around here. Two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So he's there. Mm -hmm. And that's all I can do. I'm going to, well, it's not going to matter. I, I, using perplex, I'm going to perplex up his own defense. Perplex up his own defense. Red Dagger's defense is up by one, and Yelena clears. Turn to you. Okay. Um, I guess I will start by trying to free, free in cap Yelena. Mm -hmm. with my, oh, I can't make a ranged attack because I'm adjacent to dude. That's but right. Hang on a second. Let me think about this. All right. So I could sidestep Ms. Marvel. One, two, one, two, three, four. Right? Yeah. And then she could use her TK. Mm-hmm to move Clint. Clint's range is six, so we could go... Clint needs line of fire on the square as well, right? Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to check out Mass Jelena here. Oh yeah, you can target her, no problem. So Clint would not have line of fire to this square. Right? Because of the blocking. So I, I could go here. I could go here. If I go here, oh yeah, I can still see Yelena. There's no problem there. So we're going to TK him to here, next to Ms. Marvel. Uh, no, I don't think that placement's going to work, because he would need to be on the direct diagonal here. Okay. That would clip the, the blocking there. Okay, so then if I just TK him here... Mm -hmm. Then he could see both of them. He can, yep. Can he see him? Perfect. Or is this blocking in the way? Nope. Are you sure? I am positive. Okay. You got him. All right. Mm -hmm. So that's a costed TK from Ms. Marvel. Mm -hmm. They're both going to be 18s because he was perplexed up. And I'm going to I'm going to in-cap. In-cap. Because that's the only thing Perfect. I can do is the free. So 12 on 18s. I need 6. That's a 9. Nicely done. So they're both in-capped. Okay. And then he clears, because all he did was in-cap, and Ms. Marvel took the TK action in a sidestep. Okay. So, Red Dagger will then use his Perplex to put Clint down to a 17. Okay. And then uh, Yelena has a special movement power, which grants charge and stealth. So she will charge to here. Okay. And it'll be an 11 on 17. All right. Crit hit. Ouch first crit of the game. So that's going to be four damage. Okay. Red dagger One, clears. One, two, three, four. Now I have leadership. And it's now your turn. All right. Things are looking not great for me. Um, yeah. Okay. Clint's going to attempt to break away sidestep. Okay. He gets nice. it. He's going to sidestep. One, two. Mm-hmm. He is going to dual target yep. to make a ranged attack with penetrating 11 on um, numbers. What did I say? I just perplexed. You perplexed I I down, per perplex his you down. You perplex down his defense. Yeah, that's right. So yeah. so red dagger is a 17. Yelena is an 18. Okay. And I see through hindering. Yeah, so their stealth doesn't yeah. matter. So 11 plus 11. 11. I hit 22s. So I have three damage. So tell me what happens. Um, three damage will take down Red Dagger. It'll KO him entirely? Yeah. He's on click four. 
of six. And I'm penetrating. So I think the smart move is to do that, oh. to take him out. First things first, though, he does have super senses. Oh, okay. He got a four. Okay, so, so let's can, let's take that. him out. Yep. Because Yelene is double tokened. Yep. So it's three. So one, two, three, and red dagger's gone. All right. Good job. So Clint takes a token. So then, um, if I sidestep to here, mm -hmm. then I can generate some barrier. Now she is stealthed, right? She's in stealth. So, yeah, there you go. I think you would have had it anyway. No, you had it from that square, right? Because the, the, the direct intersection is right on that corner. Kay. So you, you missed it. You All missed right. the, the hindering, is what I'm saying. I can put a barrier here. Mm, no, I need that That's one. right. You need that square that open. That one has to go there. And then I guess I'll put the other one here. Okay. Looks good. Uh, yeah, it's a bummer. Oh, I could... Yeah, has to, I have to have the line. This would block the line. It would. Yeah. Okay. But I'm double token. I can't attack next that's turn anyway. That's true. Okay, mm -hmm. and then that's my, um, my, my barrier. And then for free... I will throw this barrier yep. at Yelena. Okay. So it Which is... is an 18 defense. I'm a 9. I still have sidestep, right? Yeah, okay. 9 on 18. I need a 9 or better. Come on, dice. That's a wow, 9. Wow, you got a 9. So 2 damage into her with the barrier. Whew. Okay. One, 2. And I pass to you. Yep, she clears. Does she have anything? She has a uh, flurry. Okay. So she can no longer move and attack. But defensively? Combat reflexes. Combat and she's a reflexes. 16, I think. Printed 16. Okay. Well, I guess Clint will range her. Okay. 11 penetrating on 16. Yep. Need a 5. That's a 4. Missed it by 1. Free in cap. Okay. That'll hit. That'll hit. So she takes that. Okay. Uh, he takes a token. And Ms. Marble, uh, let's see. You have a range of four to shoot, right? Mm, one, yes. two, one, two, sidestep they back. Both, they both sidestep? Yep. Okay. So she no longer has a move and attack. She just has um, a printed move of five. Yep. So one, two, three, four. Yep. Actually, we're going to go one, two, three, four to there. Okay. And it is your turn. Okay. Let's attempt a breakaway sidestep with Clint. He gets it. He'll come to here. Okay. Uh, in capping her is not useful because she's already got two <laughs> tokens. Um, she has the traded stealth though, right? Yeah. So before I sidestep Clint, can I sidestep her here? Yep. And then can I sidestep Clint one, two? Perfect. Can I do that? Yep. Okay. Uh, barrier tokens. One, two, uh, three, four, I guess. Yep. And I'll pick up this one. Yep. And fling it at her. Fling it at her. Nine on 16. Yep. That misses. That misses. That misses by one. Yeah. Okay, so she takes a token for making her barriers, and he clears. Yep. Oh, Yelena clears. That's all she can do. All right. Um, I have leadership now. You do. Leadership on Clint. Misses. Okay, so Clint has improved targeting through characters, so he's and just going to shoot right Your barrier up. comes down, too. Oh, yeah, right? barrier comes down. So 11 on 16. Okay. Just right through Ms. Marvel. Mm-hmm. I need a five. That's a six. That's a six. So that will hit for three. Three. Let's see. Let's see if we got her. One, two, three KO'd. Woohoo! Good job. Good job. Elena goes down. Well, Thanks for playing. I that was well fought. It was well fought. It was a good game. Yeah, I think I mean I think we corrected all of the errors, which is yeah, good. Yeah, I think so. Um which helps. Most a lot. of the ones that mattered anyway. This Ms. Marvel is really good. Yeah, she's she's pretty cool. Um, as far as like she's a common, mm -hmm. right? If only I had a card for her. Um, <laughs> <laughs> if only. Uh, you know, my team of four people without leadership, without outwit, without perplex, without prob, 
Yeah. And it wasn't that your dice weren't were bad. I think I just made some good strategic decisions. You did, yeah. I mean, I feel like, other than my Yelena's, mm -hmm. um, and Red Dagger was okay, but kind of had some trashy figures here. But Well, I mean, I think, fun, I think Donnie's good. I think he's better when you can generate a demon. Yeah, for sure. You couldn't generate demons, so that made it difficult. Um, and I think we just, you know, I had two free attacks yeah. that I could make, which helped. Mm -hmm. So And that Hawkeye's amazing. He's Kurt. really good, Clint, that Clint. Clint. Yeah, hopefully I get some trick arrows to put on He's him. He's amazing. So. Yeah, All right. We'll, well get them eventually. It only took me five games, <laughs> but I finally have a win in the in the That's mental right. scoreboard. Yep. So thanks for watching. What did you think, Rob? Um. Yeah, I thought it was uh, pretty good. Yeah. Like to see that uh, Clint on the board. That was good. Hulk was scary. Um. I made a priority to take him down as soon as he jumped in the middle there. Yeah. Which was a good play for you to get get him in there and start slugging people. Yeah, I mean he had shape change, um, right? So there was a fifty like yeah. There was a good chance that he might have not been hit, but he missed a shape change. You so. had some some bad rolls. Yeah. At points. Um. Otherwise, I think you would have taken it sooner, because I, I was pretty sure I wasn't going to take this one. <laughs> I don't know. I was worried. I yeah. was worried, but uh, but it was good, and was thanks good. for playing, and yeah. let us know what you thought in the comments below. Yeah, let us you know. You can, li after liking and subscribing, of course. That would be awesome. And then you can also reach out to us in all the usual places, the socials, the email, yep. etc. cetera. And uh, we will see you next time. Yeah, yeah, we'll be back here next time with another game S of uh, Heroclix Next Phase. Single booster. Single booster. Until then, we'll say goodbye. See ya. Bye.